Uh, how did you end up at the Madeline Island Music Camp? Uh, seven years ago, my mom, uh, who had prior been working for the uh, Washburn School District, um, had got this job offer through Tom and Dale, um, and we started as a family ran. Um, it was just our, our family of six running it. Um, and as the years went by, I kind of just took a passion for cooking. Uh, my mom started a restaurant in Bayfield, and in doing so, took her away from the music camp, and then allowed me to kind of step in her shoes and fill in her place. And uh, it's been a really great experience for me. Um, passionate about food, the people I work with here are unbelievable. Um, and I just I keep coming back every summer. It's it's a beautiful place to work, it's a beautiful place to live, and they take good care of you. You know, it's couldn't ask for a whole lot more. So, are you in charge of the menu entirely? Absolutely, entirely. Um, input from all. I have three other employees, um, and we all give our own input. At the end of the day, is I kind of do have the final say, but there's a lot of good stuff going on. Um, uh, we definitely do our scheduling by ourselves for the food menu. Um, all of it, all of it's our own, you know, take on the food, uh, take on the variety we want to do, whether it be for vegan, vegetarian, gluten-free, um, just kind of all walks of life that we can cater to with the food here. So, um, what's, what, you know, there's... <laughs> okay, so there's kind of an emphasis on excellence up here when it comes to music it's some of the best students uh, judging by the comments people are making about your food uh, they're pretty happy about it so talk to me about your values when it comes to food um, cooking food is a fine art um, there's there's nothing about it that's necessarily easy but there's a lot about it that's really really fun there's a lot of good um, energy I would say about cooking good food um, the, the feedback you get from other people makes it that much easier to cook good food but in my eyes um, it's more of the, the personal enjoyment I get for feeding other people. Um, it's not all along lines of, you know, me doing it because I need money or me doing it because it's something that comes easy for me. It's because I love to do it. Um, and like having kids come up to me throughout the day and tell me how good the food is and that we're doing an excellent job and that they're able to request things and I don't even have to think about telling them yes or no. I just know how to do it. And it's just, it's a very, very, very good thing for me to, to stay on top of as in like a food idea just because I know that I know that I'm pretty good with food and it, it just makes me feel that much better about myself about cooking my food when people are so much willing to come up to me and tell me how good of a job I'm right now fast I'm Jordan Holman I work for the Madeline Island Music Camp and I allow John to use this footage for his documentary um, food is very comparable to a large a large portion of me to the instrument world is in music um, culinary arts is no different than learning how to play violin. Um, whether it be using a knife or frying in a pot, everything takes its own technique. And um, I wouldn't discredit anyone for being a great chef or being a great musician. It's all your own art and your own taste that you put to it. Um, and with that being said, I would say that I would love myself just as much if I was a great musician, just as much as I would love myself if I was a great cook. Perfect, we just ran out of, right on the moment, so we're... we're.